You want to cover him again? One on one? Tell me you want him? Throwing on first down is Rogers. Looking for Jones and it's intercepted. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Are you kidding me? Wow. Wow. I got to see that again. Fuck. Wow. That's something. Ah, uh, fuck. Out of the back of the end zone, so we will start here at the 25. Damn. The Packer offense ready to get their next drive underway. And they gave up the pick six. And now they'll be looking to right the ship here. Now, as a quarterback, are you a little more cautious this go around? You should be, just because after what you gave up. But you can't be so cautious as to just really take things in, and now you're not going to pull loose enough to give your team a chance to score. But you still have to be careful, because those defensive guys, I know the reputation defense guys can't catch. All evidence to the contrary on that last possession, though. Second and 11 now. Rodgers, and it's complete to Adams. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. Right at him. Right at him. Damn. And you know, a lot of people look at these guys and they think to themselves that maybe, possibly, they're still thinking about the first one. And they probably are. I think in this case, he's just trying to atone for the first interception. Trying a little bit too hard, maybe forced it a bit. And instead created a second one. On first down, Tonga Bailoa. You gotta be kidding me. What the fuck is going on here? What kind of fucking shit these guys running wide open? Running wide open. Unbelievable. from the end zone and ultimately cannot get this out to the 25 yards <sighs> definitely I'm fucking definitely rattled the Packer thought I picked that it would have been my ball change the whole game fucking Randy Moss and me just any interception are you a little bit more cautious when you start that next drive or no you just throw that out the window I think you are. I don't think that there's any way you can run back out there and go, ah, totally didn't affect me. Let's just go ahead and be loose with the football again. You're going to take care of it, but you have to be careful about being too cautious because now you can't run any offense at all. Still want to attack. We'll see how they attack them here. Now left side on the swing pass. First down and much more here for Jones. And finally taken down at the 44-yard line. Back to back good plays have him on the move on first down. Rodgers with a give. It's Aaron Jones. And the running lanes non existent in this first half as they'll stop him behind the line. He'll lose a yard there and it's second and 11. Quick throw caught out wide by Valdez Scantling. And he's got another first down as he's brought down at the Dolphins 33. 
Well, these guys have definitely been outplayed in the first half, but I like their countenance. I like the way that they haven't panicked out there, the way they're carrying themselves. They're starting to move the ball, and what you have to do, maintain your poise and start to put together some drives. And we've hit the two-minute mark in this first half of action. A reminder, coming up at halftime, Jonathan Coachman will join us from Orlando with our halftime report. But business to take care of before we get there. A two-minute drill before the coaches' two-minute drill. Now a first down carry by Jones. And he still has yet to get on track in this first half as they're going to stop him behind the line. That's going to wind up a loss of a full three yards on first down. That loss of three, a rare stumble on a promising drive. Here's second and 13. Not good. Not good. Not good. Miami as they get set to start the drive. And now consider the lead. The question is how much is good enough? Are you going for more? Thank you. This is intercepted. My goodness. Devondre Campbell. Thank you. Keep me back in the game. So the ball down to the 16 here for first and 10. Trying to shake off the interception, he'll look to throw. And he's got it. It's caught for a Packers touchdown. Josiah DeGuara. There to make the grab. And the Packers are back within a score. Rodgers will throw for it. And his pass is intercepted for the fourth time today. Picked up by Xavier Howard. Unbelievable. He's at the 50. He's at the 30. Nah, it's two points. He takes it all the way back. It's a pick two, if you will, as head play backfires in a big way. Now after the touchdown, here's Crosby to kick it away. Waddle will return this from the end zone. And he'll be stopped right around where he would have been had he gone down to a knee, maybe a yard shy of there at the 24. First down Miami as they get set to start the drive. And last time was it pretty. One play and an interception. We'll see if they can do better. Oh, not big. Now on this drive, after what happened on the last one, throw it on the first play. Give the quarterback some confidence. See what happens. So now second and ten after the incompletion on first down. They'll run now with Gaskin. They do get a couple, but they'll be left staring at a third and eight coming up. The Packers going to use one of their timeouts as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds to go in the first half. Throwing his tongue of Iloa on third down here. Oh, he rifles one, and that's going to be intercepted. Picked off at about the 31, and he'll take this down inside the 15-yard line. So the first thing that crossed my mind is why didn't they just sit on the lead and take it to the locker room? They're in good shape. Absolutely. And from this spot on the field, now you've given the other side a chance for points here going into intermission. Yeah, you changed the momentum of the game, and it's something you did not need to do. And the Packers are going to have a first and goal as some good running there gets them down to about the two-yard line, knock it on the door. First and goal, and they got to be thinking a chance to get right back into this football game. Now the Packers going to go ahead and use the second of their timeouts as they'll stop the clock with 12 seconds to go in this first half.
They'll try and run it in with Jones. And he'll take this one in for a Packer touchdown. Aaron Jones in the final seconds of the first half. And the Packers are able to cut into this lead in the final seconds of the first half. So now Rodgers will lead the Packers up to go for two. They'll look to throw. Throws left side. And he's got it. They convert for two, and that gets them even closer. Now a two-point game. Boy, they're down only one score. Still first half. But they're going to line up for the onside kick. And the oh, I was trying to steal the moment. I was trying to steal it. <laughs> doesn't it that they thought they had the right situation <laughs> and the right approach and going after it also may signal that they feel like they have the superior team that they can try these sorts of things and it won't come back and whatever take your three points i'm back in the game are you trying to let me back in it is that what's trying to go on here and we welcome you back now Side Charles Davis on Brandon Gordon getting set for quarter number three here. Crosby on now to kick it away. I'm re I'm clipping this game, so you blame with Danielle. I'm gonna show it to her. You could go back on the PS the PlayStation, like rewind and clip the like, um shit that you already played. So I can go back yeah, I can go yeah, I can go back like an hour and clip it the whole whatever happened like the, for the me at last power hour of gaming. Imagine the overall halftime tone was a positive one, but what do you think the talking points were? Give me that! What's happening, Josh? What's happening, Tua? Let's go! Let's go! Give me some! Pick six and a Packer touchdown. Well, dare I say it, it's kind of quid pro quo. Both defenses now with an interception return for a touchdown. Your vocabulary, sir. Well done. So after the INT, it's Rodgers. And the Packers are going to have first and goal as they try to finish off this drive with six points. Oh, come on. Come on. Get there, boys. God, I want to take that. I want to take a two thing lead, and I'm going to run this clock all the way out. Yeah, you got me there. Yeah, I tried getting you. I was so close to hitting you. I was close. I'm close to getting that, Joshy. Tua being Tua, baby. Rodgers is getting hot. To get their next drive underway. And we have seen a lot on the scoreboard here in this quarter. So you, you, sometimes you talk to me about tendency breakers on offense. These defenses struggling. Are there tendency breakers on defense? All defensive coordinators keep something in their hip pocket for these types of situations. What can we do to slow down the onslaught? But the biggest thing is make sure these guys encourage each other. Oh! Oh! It's been a really tough ball game trying to stop these offenses. Oh, it really has, especially as of late. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. On play action, Rodgers rolling to his right. And he hits his target, the tight end Lewis. And he'll lose yardage. Brought down at the 32. <sighs> so that one a disaster. A big loss there with second down coming up. <laughs> 
Rodgers now to throw. Here's a diving catch right side. So now first and 10 as they've crossed into Miami territory at the 48-yard line. Here's Rodgers to throw. Guys, pass interference. Are we going to call pass interference? Giving up a few first downs on this drive, but getting the incompletion there, that should give them something to build on and maybe turn the tide. Here's second and 10. Rodgers going to give this one to Dillon. Oh, he's got a little daylight. 20. And he almost made it, but just short. Finally out of bounds, right down around the goal line. 70 yards for him on the ground now, as he has been terrific here this afternoon. After the big play, a chance to finish now on first and goal. On the sneak, Rodgers. And no signal, but I don't think he got the surge behind center. No, he's going to be kept out of the end zone. Rodgers with a keeper. And just a short gain that time as they're able to get him down. Only a yard on the sneak, not what he was hoping for, and it's third down. Get in there. Is needed on the sneak. He didn't get it, and now it's fourth down. They'll go for it. It's Rodgers. Touchdown, Packers. Robert Tunyon. There to make the grab. And once again, the Packers, they're back out in front. You get down near the goal line, this is where having a sure-handed tight end becomes a luxury. And it pays off big time, especially when the defense sells out against the run. And he finds himself open for an easy touchdown. They'll try and throw for it. And his pass is intercepted for the fourth time today. Picked up by Javon Holland. He's at the 50. 30. Past the 20. The greatest and he show takes it all the way. Ah, it's golly. A if you will, his head play backfires in a big way. And Come on, I'm right there. Unsuccessful there on the onside kick try. I got to steal that possession. I can't stop you. First and ten. This will be caught. It's Waddle. Touchdown. Jalen Waddle. 46 yards. And the Dolphins are once again going to retake the lead. I can't believe I'm saying this, but in today's NFL, I wouldn't want to play defense. Too many great receivers and guys who are accurate who can get them the ball. We've seen the result. Days like this one. Extra point up and good by Sanders, and that will make this. Oh my gosh, it's crazy. After the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Sanders. I can't take the same way. And that one will bounce out of the back of the end zone, so we will start here at the 25. The Packer offense ready to get their next drive underway. And it's a unit last drive that did it all on the ground, Charles. And they controlled it from the interior, big on big, right? Offensive lineman versus defensive lineman. But you know, in order to keep the football moving downfield, other people have to get involved as well. Your I saw receivers, him. your tight ends, lead runners, anything that you have possible to get in front and keep the ball moving. And now the defense may be looking out for a pass coming up. Running on first down is Jones, but he's not going to get much. Maybe a couple. And second down. 
Sometimes with the running game, you've just got to stick with it. Look, it's the third quarter, no time to panic. But that also doesn't mean you just do it the same way you've been doing it the entire ball game. Maybe change up some blocking ah, assignments or run a few different wanted. plays, but stay with the overall essence of the running game. Second down, another shot for Jones. And he will be brought down at about the 43 that time. Another two-yard gain there, but they'll need to do better this time. It's third and six. From the gun, it's Rodgers. Got his man complete over the middle. That's Lewis. And he is going to have a Packers first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Out of the shotgun, it's Jones. Dancing away at the 35. And he's corralled, but not before getting it inside the 35. 40 yards rushing on 12 carries for him now. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. To throw is Rodgers. Damn it, make a fucking play. Make a fucking move on him. On the play back at the 37-yard line. So both offenses come to life here in this third quarter as this is shaping Did you let me back in it? Josh. Did you let me back in the game? That'll leave him with two remaining. We'll be back after Before. This. You threw those interceptions on purpose. gone five and it's going to bring up a third at about seven left this has been an up and down back and forth type of a game hasn't it maybe this long drive took a little bit of the wind out of their sails kind of settled things down a little bit Rodgers on third down. The left side completion to Jones. And they're going to get him down well short of the first as he can only get this to the 30. They'll get only a yard out of that and it'll bring up fourth down. Now Rodgers got to have this one. And he'll be touched out here but not before he does pick up the first. They go back to the ground with Jones. And he'll maneuver his way forward for about four. Second and six. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. Shotgun now for Rodgers. And it's a Packers touchdown. I run that I run out of that formation I run that play out of like seven different formations so I guess it's there's like seven different plays out of all that no this it's it's really it's a lot it's in a lot of playbooks but that's just one I play with just because I like the other shit that runs with the pistol and everything in the run game Turn this from the end zone. And that decision to bring it out ends up not being a good one. Cost him about five yards as he's tackled it to 20. First down Miami as they get set to start the drive. 
And they will be looking to answer the touchdown. Their defense just surrendered. Oh, yeah, you better have gave that off. You about to fucking get smoked. Let's go. Bound, ground that fucking ball down to the... Ground that clock down. I'm here with it. I'm here about it. They had to walk away from that field. I'm like, okay, I can stand up when the going gets tough in here. Under a heavy rush, and down he goes. Rashawn Gary coming in hard there on the blitz, and he gets him seven yards behind the line of scrimmage. Possibly a turning point. Big play coming. This is third and long. Hold on. Now to it. What's up? But the pressure there on third down, forcing the errant pass. Fourth down coming up. I think he had to unload that one before he wanted to. He was right up in his grill. I think he was a dentist there without a license, don't you? <laughs> Just not enough time for the play to develop. Just lucky it wasn't a fumble, really. One score down. Here we go. They're going to go for it here on fourth down. They're going for it. Here's Tua with it. Fighting room at the 30. Finally taken down at the 32-yard line. Tell you what, he's been able to put the ball in some tight spots all game long. That throw, no different. Yeah, a lot of people would call it a gutsy type of a throw. I think he looks at it as... I can do it, so it's not that big of a deal to me, and I'm going to keep firing. Here's Gaskin. And he'll maneuver his way forward for about four, second and six. The run got four, now they deal with a second and six. Here's Tua. They get this out wide to Gaskin. And just three yards on the catch there, he couldn't get away. And that's going to lead to a third down. So the Dolphins have it as we welcome you back in. They face a critical third down now, needing a score here in the late going. And this is caught by Parker. Room here to run. And he'll be taken down, but not before he works it past the 50. Now you're right on the edge of field goal range. You've still got time, but get up to the line of scrimmage and get set. Now a handoff here to his running back. And nothing doing. He's immediately taken down at the line of scrimmage. Call it no gain on the play, and it'll be second down. On the right side open is Gasicki. And he'll go out of bounds after taking it a little further down inside the 40. Nine yards, not quite enough, and they'll be left now with third and one. Now Tua. Oh, what a heck of an effort there as he'll make the diving catch. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. Two and a throw. And that one drops down, incomplete. Good coverage there, forced the ball free, and it's second down. So after the incompletion on first, now second and 10. And they'll run on the inside handoff. And he's going to get this one down to the 30. He'll get only three there, so it leaves him with a third and seven ahead. Tua. And his pass is intercepted for the fourth time today. Rasul Douglas picks it. There he goes, right side. The 20. And into the end zone. It's a pick six and a Packer touchdown. So they were in field goal range, a chance to get this one to OT. Got a little greedy going for the win, cost him the game. Not just a little greedy, now a little lost because of what ended up happening. Just what you stated there, they're in field goal range. Instead of getting conservative, they decided to press it, maybe try and win it right now. Instead, the whole thing backfired. Now after the touchdown, here's Crosby to kick it away. From the 10. And a good effort on the return there. Gets him across the 30, up to the 33. The Dolphins at the line, ready for their next drive. 
This is just an exercise in futility. Do you, do you even bother running a play here offensively? I wouldn't because now is not going to erase what's happened during the game. So after it's over, you're going to go to the film, find out where the game was really lost. But this is not a situation now where you're going to make up for anything. We'll see what they do here. A big offense.